Hi, Aquarius Collective. Um, it's Elle here to do a quick reading. This will be for the rest of, uh, I was about to say April, wow, August 2020, okay? And then I'm going to get some of the September readings out. Um, Aquarius, Aquarius, Aquarius. All right, so some of you, what Spirit wants you to know is that no, that job you're in, that business you were trying to put all your time, energy, effort behind, it's probably not where you need to be. Um, it says that some of you guys are, are soul searching. You've walked away. You've emotionally checked out of however you make money, how you earn income, earned income, not money given to you, but earned income. You don't want to do this anymore. Whatever it may be, um, you're not satisfied. You're not fulfilled. You may be showing up to that job virtually, most of us, um, or in person every day, but wishing you were somewhere else, knowing that there's more for you out there, knowing that you have the capability, um, the mental, the intellect, to start something new or start something of your own. What spirit wants you to do is be focused right now. Be focused on the money aspect, your money, the money in your bank account, the money not in your bank, the money that didn't hit your bank account yet. Be focused in terms of you want to be as financially stable as possible before you move or start something new, before you move into something new. You're longing and hoping for something better, and it's here, but Spirit wants you to know it's not going to come without hard work, dedication. You got the King of Wands here. He's all about focus, okay? Um, he has the idea. He moves on the idea. He doesn't wait. He doesn't say, well, maybe next week, maybe next year. No, it's now. They want you to come out of, for some of you, this might be for some of you. See, somebody's giving some of you money. They're, they're bankrolling you. They, they finance your whole life. Kudos to you. But some of you want to come out of that, right? This card, none of my cards are reversed in my deck. But this card, as I was shuffling, wanted to flip out and reverse. The devil in reverse. So some of you, the message for you is you, you have to come out of... Um, the situation with um, maybe somebody giving you money, you're not making enough money, you're having a poverty mindset, you blowing money, throwing it away, being wasteful, materialistic. It says we're not going to get anywhere. Spirit is saying we're not going to get anywhere with that mindset. We'll, we'll end up in that same circle. So spirit wants you to check yourself and you only know, you know, you, I don't know you. I don't know what you do. Um, and some of you may say, well, I'm not materialistic, but if you have to have Starbucks every morning, um, uh, uh, fettuccine Alfredo from the most expensive Italian restaurant every night, spirit is asking you, Hey, where do you really want to be? What do you really want to do? And if you really want to do that, please watch your spending. Make sure you're not getting yourself come out of that. Come out of um, making choices that are going to get you um, feeling trapped again. Feeling like you're in that same old cycle. Okay? Because you, whatever you're thinking about, Aquarius, you have a really good idea. And it says you have the resources. And some of you might even be waiting on resources. Good money. I mean, excuse me, good news about money. And it's going to come to you, but... The news says that you need to do something in order for something to get going. So the news, it's almost as a, a conditional message. Like, well, you can have this X, Y, Z if you. So there's conditions surrounding this message about money. And then you go into a place of, okay, I've left whatever that was behind. Selfishness, greedy. Uh, spending too much, eating out, eating out too much, um, 
buying expensive items that I really, really, really didn't need. Um, whatever it may be, you left it behind. And or you are getting the message that, yes, do the paperwork on that business. Get that, get that started. And now you're at a place of just waiting for things to come to fruition, a completion. Like, okay, I've got everything in order. And it says once you get in that mind frame and you do the work, you have the sun and the ace of pentacles. So this could be very fruitful for you. Always remember this is just the beginning. Um, you could receive a large sum of money. For some of them here, it's just the beginning. Like it could continue, you know, depending on you. Some of you could be waiting for judgment, waiting for news about money. And it's coming, okay? Um, because you have courthouse here, okay? And then uh, you have concern. Some of you concerned about, will I have, have enough money? Can I do this? Is this really for me? Should I leave my job? That's your concern. Um, but Spirit is already giving you the plan. Just move on it because you're going to have great fortune, okay? And look at those two cards. It's going to be blessed. This is... This is a blessed ending and beginning, okay? You may even, once again, good news about finances. Maybe you have to learn something else. Uh, maybe someone gives you an idea. Um, and it allows you to walk away what's not, walk away from what is not fulfilling you in your occupation, in your business, and whatever it may be. So we'll jump into love, okay? Some of you just want to go all in, I mean, balls to the wall, for real. Um, or this is someone else, you know. Um, this is how they feel about you. The Ace of Cups here at the bottom of the deck. Um, somebody wants to really just say, you know, F it. We, we love each other. We like each other. Let's move in together. Let's whatever. I'm ready. And the other person is kind of, hey, 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 what do you, let's, let's slow it down. Um, because this person could be concerned about, this could be you, Aquarius, or the other person. Am I going to be in despair again about this person? Is it all going to fall apart? If we move too fast, will it just fall apart just as fast? That's someone else's concern here. So they keep, maybe they, they're keeping, uh, they're setting the pace of this relationship. They feel like you guys are soulmates, twin flames, or um, you guys were meant to meet be in each other's life, maybe for the long term. And once again, there's a rebuilding here. Somebody looks at you, Aquarius, as a solid individual that they want in their life for a long time. And they want to offer you something stable. And or you feel this way about someone else. Um, but they also kind of have the side eye. I don't know for what, I don't know what happened. I don't know if there was a fallout, um, but you guys, you, it looks like you're going to get what you want. You have the nine of cups here, so you'll get what you want, but it's not coming on your terms, in your time frame, how you want it to come, how it should look for you, and what they should be doing, and they should be saying, and they, you, that, no, 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 and you guys may even be separated from this person. And they may even just be testing the waters with you. Even though you guys have a significant history. Okay, so you may be saying, well, why, why are they just kind of like being around a bush and being so coy or being so, um, you know, kind of shy about moving forward? Well, there's concern and, and someone doesn't want to... Um, feel you know desperate or despair or um 
yeah, they don't want to feel this anymore. And or this is you, Aquarius. So it looks like love is going in the right way. So is career. It's just that you're not you're not taking the lead on this, Aquarius. Some of you aren't. Um, it's not going how you wrote it down in your journal, how you imagined, but it's here for you. So that's a good thing. Um, some of you, once again, I don't know if this is coming up, it's waiting for judgment, judgments, uh, something to do with the courthouse, or something to do with um, money. Some of you are, are expecting, um, so you may be getting married soon. Some of you have gone to the courthouse, you've done the paperwork, and you're just waiting for the certific certificates and, and so forth. Some of you, to, to establish this business, you need to go down to your, your local courthouse, your local jurisdiction, and get the paperwork done on this business. So that just came up for me. For, for you, to me, right? Um, love is looking good. Just know, Aquarius, if, it, if you feel like at any point, oh, I'm not going to get what I want. Oh, you know, you feel despair. No, just know you have great fortune, not just in money, but in love, too. It's just that some someone, so there's an aspect of someone being older and younger or more mature, and the other might be a little immature. So somebody is, um, it, you know, it's the seesaw. It's, um, it's not imbalanced to the point where it's just like we can't be together, but it's almost as if you guys balance each other out. So... That's an issue. Some of you, it's, you're going to courthouse and, and money because you're trying to get unraveled, untangled from maybe it, what you thought was an unfair judgment in terms of maybe alimony, child support, because we have mother and father here in our shells. Okay, somebody you feel like, or the other person feels like you, of course, somebody has... Um, Sorry, it fell. Mental issues here. And this is not a laughing matter. Mental issues. Okay. Um, someone feels like somebody needs to really deal with that. Okay. Um, and, then, and then things can move forward. Or things would be better if someone dealt with the mental issues. Once again, in the shells, Aquarius, business. Where is this camera? Okay, business. Okay, yeah. So, I just heard somebody is all up in your business. or And for some of you, it's just establish this business. Do the groundwork. Get it done. It can work. It won't work. Move, 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 move. Don't wait any longer. Okay? Some of you are separated from this love interest because somebody had to do some soul searching. They had to ask the hard questions for themselves, about themselves. The answers were, were were or are within them. This is when you're looking for answers to questions about you outside of yourself. You're asking friends, you're asking family, you are inquiring of others about you and spirit, God, universe, whatever you want to call it, says no. You know the answers. Because it's right here in front of you. This is your life experience. Or, you know. So that's why somebody is separated from you. Or, may, or you may have feel like they ghosted you. Or you may be using ghosted them. But somebody, it wasn't a thing of, I don't love you. I don't want to be with you. It was like, I have so much going on with myself. I need to, I need to get myself together. Okay? All right. So um, what you want to say to your person, Aquarius, is addicted. Now, you fill in the blank, addicted to, addicted, yeah, addicted to, 
I don't know. Maybe you may, you want to say you're addicted to them, to your partner, or maybe you want to say somebody that somebody is coming out of an addiction. Also, you know, um, codependency addiction was playing a part here, and somebody is um, what you're saying to your partner is addicted. Maybe they were addicted to something, and that was the demise. The of the relationship, it was, you know, where all the destruction stemmed from. You want to say to your partner, so what? I lied, I'm a narcissist. Now, this could be you saying this to your partner in terms of this how you feel about yourself. Or it's just, you're saying, hey, this is, this is you, partner. This is how you feel toward me. You, you lie. Because you're a narcissist. Back to mental issues. Okay. Uh, someone needs to deal with that. What your partner wants to say to you, Aquarius, is maturing. They could be maturing. Um, this relationship is maturing them. Their finances. All of this. Um, or you both are maturing. That's what they want to say to you. They want to say to you, I'm happiest when I'm with you. Very self-explanatory. Very nice. Then your partner pull soulmates twin flame. So this is how they feel about the connection. They understand it and they see it for what it is. But just because you understand something and you see it for what it is, it doesn't mean you jump right into it or you want to jump into it or you're ready for it. Um, someone can sit you in a trigonometry class and you can say, I understand this and I know what it is, but you know what? I'm also not ready for it, nor do I want to do it. <laughs> so it's the same way. They understand what the relationship is and what it means, but they just had to get to a place of being ready. It, it feels like they are. It feels like you're going to get what you want, Aquarius, but work with this person, okay? Um, if you, you only know your life. If you're dealing with Someone who's just not workable. All right, you know that. I don't know it. You saw the, oh my God, those cards just flipped out. Okay. Aquarius, yeah, don't stop. Don't stop. Um, don't stop believing in this relationship. Don't stop believing in yourself and your dreams. Look, Aquarius, no need to worry. Please stop. Meditation brings answers. Sit with yourself. Sit with yourself and just listen to whatever comes. Communicate clearly, okay, with um, your other, your better half and the other person, or maybe even your job. Communicate clearly. Uh, you have a timeline a year from now. Your life will probably look completely different. I'm hoping it will for the better. Let's see what else is going on here. Let's see what Aquarius should be focused on going forward. Aquarius be focused on more. Oh my god. All right, seeking and finding. Yep. You might have to, like I said, you might have to learn something or what what business license, certificate, whatever I need to start, whatever it is I'm trying to start. So Aquarius, the cards are asking you, look, I know you want to be so spiritually minded, some of you out there, but right now you need to be practical. Get on that internet, get on that machine, that Google, find it, find out what you need to do. Seek and you will find, okay? Seek it and find it. Okay, courage. Yes, have the courage to act to not react but act in all situations in all aspects of life okay uh all right and it flipped out for us changing your mind okay i don't know what this could be about but you some of you could be changing your mind maybe about a person maybe about a job a business uh i did mention in the beginning some of you may be in that job or that business and just putting so much behind it. You might be changing your mind about that. I'm not sure. 
Um, you have to get a personal reading just to pull your own energy. You know, this is only general, right? Family changes. Somebody wants to, I, I did see that in the cards. I might have not mentioned it. So, like, some of you want to go head first or someone, you're dealing with wants to go head first and let's move in together. Let's just do this. Let's jump. Let's just jump. And whatever happens with the jump, you just deal with it. Um, so moving in together, a new baby, a new car, a new home, just changes all together surrounding not just you, but those who you you deem as your family. Because family comes in different you know, definitions. All right. Okay. Sobriety. Wow. So, like I said, somebody's addiction or what they were addicted to. Some of you are staying sober because we have the devil in reverse. This is the, I mean, like this card just flipped out, right? This is how this card flipped out in reverse. None of my, the deck is not reversed. I don't do reverses. Not, not that I have anything against it. Um, Somebody's sobriety is, is, is uh, putting them in a, in a place of just wanting better, wanting more for themselves, for their family, having them change their mind about certain things, certain ways they were or are. Somebody is thinking soberly. It might, it might not even be that their mind was clouded with substance abuse, but just overthinking, overindulging in, you know, other things. Could be food, hanging out, friends just so that they wouldn't have to um, have a clear and sober mind and face uh, issues that they need to face in their life. So somebody is really definitely um, getting sober, thinking clearly about seeing a bigger picture is what I'm hearing. Relationship dynamic. Somebody feels differently now. The dynamic of the relationship has changed. They, it could have been two. Now there's three. It could have been none. Now there's three options are great but the dynamic of of your relationship of your your life um, of a significant relationship has changed you might feel differently the other person might feel differently um, so then then comes changing your mind so somebody could be changing their mind Aquarius the, uh, the last well the end of August the last few days left in August look interesting for you very encouraging not a bad read at all. No bad cards. Um, act on this energy. Um, meditate. Pray. Get by yourself and, and really listen to yourself, okay? Aquarius, if you feel like this resonated with you and you want a personal reading, you can go over to the website, book your own reading there. Uh, also, you can take advantage of the text question you can text a question or eight to the number below pay for your question on your mobile device to receive the answer to your question via text take advantage of that okay if you um see fit thank you aquarius many blessings to you